Okay, so if you would talk a little bit about how you decide the nutrition needs for each individual horse. So basically when a horse comes in, I evaluate what have they been doing, what are they going to be doing, and what does their general appearance look like? Um, so if, if I were to look at this horse, I've had him uh, maybe a month and a half now. So he, oh, like okay. said, he's, he's a work in progress. Oh. So, you know, if my initial impression, if I just saw this horse today, I'd say, you know, he needs 150 pounds. He needs some muscling. Um, and his coat's a little dull. So, you know, I would say, okay, we might need to consider, you know, are we nutritionally balanced? Because that can cause kind of that burnt looking coat. Uh -huh. He's also from Texas, which I've had a lot of horses from Texas that kind of come with that burnt coat. Yeah. And I don't really know what it is. I don't know if it's just being out in the sun. Climate. Or, yeah. So, yeah, deficient in something. I'm not sure exactly what that is. So. Um, so I'm going to evaluate that. I'm going to evaluate their body type as well. Mm -hmm. You know, this horse, even though he's a little on the leaner side, he's heavier muscled than mm -hmm. some horses you'll see. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, he's got a ton of muscle here, a ton of muscle there, mm -hmm. um, you know, a great hind end. Mm -hmm. So he's another one. You watch the sugar because those heavier muscled horses, A, they can't dissipate heat as quickly. Yes. And that makes them that much more prone to, again, tying up and your your day is done when yes. a horse ties up and normally you're you're on fluids for a while yes. after that yes. um you know depending it's very rare that i don't put a horse on a supplement like platinum okay. you know because they're working so hard they need it um, and what is in that one it's basically Remind amino acids okay. and kind of trace minerals and basic like a basic platform for Got what it. you need and you, do you mix that in with? I mix that in with their feet? normal grains and okay. whatnot. Yep. Um, so say this horse came into me really like like barcode, for example, is a much heavier weight horse. Um, you know, that's when I would say let's maybe put him a slow feed hay bag, maybe, so he okay. can still free feed, but that their gut's still moving. Yes. You know, and these horses unfortunately sometimes live in stalls because they get into trouble if they go out. Yes. You know, so we got to keep them grazing. So basically, it's just I take an overall picture and say, what are our goals? What are we now? What do we need to be at? Yep. And it depends on the workload. You know, there's no one answer fits all.